Whoa! We have to open the post office, I think. I don't see why not. And I want to say that that probably involves doing something as simple as finding a clock face. Probably. Uh, I don't see why not. In that case, um... <laughs> uh, this is gonna be really fun because I, um, you only go so many places here, you know? And as far as my knowledge, I'm just not entirely sure where exactly I uh, go at this point. Hmm, how about that? But hey, there's always, uh, rummaging through Tony's house again. There's probably not much point in that, but hey, we haven't been here in a while. So, so, yeah, there's zero point in this, never mind. To somewhere else, probably. I can only imagine. Or I could, of course, as always, cheat. Uh, lever shouldn't do anything anymore. Maybe, maybe, let's find out. It's already open. Yeah, that it is. Uh, never mind then. Perfect. Uh, yeah. Well, hey, we can always probably ask Gizmo about it, maybe. Uh, maybe. Maybe. Hey, Gizmo, you got a clock? My Hello, friend? Dr. Gizmo. Yes, what is it? Uh, da, 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 da. I'll Everybody. be back. Wonderful. I can't wait to see you again. Oh, how nice. Thanks. Hey, Hennick, you got anything to say that is important and of interest? I'm Hello gonna guess again? no. Hey! Hello, sugar pup. No. <sighs> oh, da, 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 da. Never mind. Uh, talk to you later. Bye, sugar pup. Uh, yeah, about that. What should have to do with the emergency, or uh, the detonation plans? Probably does. I don't see why it wouldn't. Um, but I don't see why it wouldn't have to do with a lot of things. That or I just have to get, um, I forgot her name. The clerk. Inspector Gizmo speaking. You have an emergency to report? Uh, sure. Yes. Tony has thrown out my drum set, and I had just installed a paintball mode. Darn. Rufus. Yes. Please don't block the line. The operator is already stressed out. But this is about my rights as an ex-boyfriend. I. Uh, oh man, I hate radio calls. Sucks. I wonder if Wenzel is inside his own house. Wouldn't that be something? I guess not, huh? Unless he's still in the basement. Uh, no, he's not. Well... That sucks. I gotta talk to my good friend Wenzel. It's all I wanted. It's all I've ever wanted in life. Hey, Tony, you got anything to say? Uh, da, 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 da. I've gotta go. <sighs> I've been saying that for years, but here How you rude. still are. Seriously, the nerve of some people. Um, bum, 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 bum. What among this can be used as a clock face? It doesn't have to be siphon. Uh, da, 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 da. Good question. You like the planet's magnetic field. Or I could try and find the mag has something to do with everything. Oh no, I've got dumbass. I can't believe you would swear, Rufus. I'm seriously going to beat you. There's always our fun roadmap. Um Yeah. I honestly forget what exactly the um god what ex uh, what what is what the uh, what what exactly uh what we could uh 
What exactly do the vouchers get me? Wasn't it just like a supply of nails, basically? Uh, da 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 da. You know, Tony, I've been through a lot lately. You don't say. If you didn't injure yourself all the time, I wouldn't have any fun in my life at all. But in case something happens to you again, you know where to find my first aid kit. Well, sheesh. I've got to go. <sighs> Betty. Oh, okay. This is what Paul even do. Cage used to hang, but he couldn't cope with her, so he skedaddled. He died of old age. Yeah, whatever you say. After you accidentally infected him with progeria. Oh, jeez. You know, I like my version better. Uh, yeah, how about that? Well. Uh, is it cheating time, fellas? I think it may, in fact, be cheating time. Uh, or I, you know, just go back into the mayor's office. Oh, hey, look, a clock! How convenient! I'm, gonna, <laughs> I'm just gonna have to, uh, you like that, my good friend? Yeah? Yeah? What, is he gonna wake up or something? Doubtful. This should have been where I looked first. <laughs> Long fingers, silent steps. The perpetrator was Rufus. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Okay then. He'll this never be like... anything but a slug of bed. Well, I mean, he is the mayor, so there's that. But eh. here's the fun part. I have a clock now. Slip that into the opening hours um, point. I think the post office is open. Me, oh my! I think. Yeah, right. You didn't Thanks, expect Lottie. that, did ya? <laughs> no. No, right? <laughs> we hit it, guys. Into the post office with me. Hey, new area, new area. Ooh, the radio. How nice. Oh, a hatch. Let's just open that up. Why not? It's probably like outgoing mail, maybe. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. So a cat licks the stamps. What? Well, I hope it knows what it's doing. A bit too slow or a bit too fast, and whoops a daisy, the package gets the wrong postage. So that's how the USPS does it. Any <laughs> Another cat. A cat in a hamster wheel. Aww, cute and strange. This place is run by cats. What did the heck? This? Neither mic nor headphones. Oh, must I do everything myself? Well, I have a microphone. Um, and I have a funnel. Sounds about right. Old timey phone time. Hey, Postbot, how you doing? Uh, hi. Please. Yeah, exactly. Um, I uh, want to uh, make a radio call. Where can call? I make a radio call? Outgoing radio calls can be made from every registered private radio device. And uh, where would, where would I, I find, find one of these? Registered private devices. There is no radio device registered for long distance calls. What's that oh, supposed to mean? Well, it has to be possible to make outgoing calls somehow. Not while using a private radio device. So, uh, absolutely, are there absolutely no, no long, long distance, distance devices? devices? There are no long distance devices except the listening post of the post office and the reserve system in the vault. Well, reserve system so there in the are vault, two of them say. after all. Both devices are not cleared for public use. Damn. Um, uh, da, 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 da. well, I would like to place, I a, place forwarding a forwarding request. request. State the reason for your forwarding request. Well, I'll be living in Elysium in the future. So, yeah. importance error. Huh? Are, are the there other radio devices registered? There are three registered devices for local calls. One is situated in the mayor's office, ah. another at the front desk counter in the town hall. Oh, the communication yeah. system of the emergency station is the third one. But it's only possible to make internal calls from there? Well, that's perfect. Well, uh... Da, 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 da. I'd like to register a private radio device 
for long distance calls. Very well. Where shall the device be installed? Um, Tony's house is located in Grid Square 4, right at the East Tunnel exit. Your huh. order has been placed. The installation of the device will presumably be completed in calendar week 63. Hold what? up. That's a quarter of a year from now. I'll have long since left Kuvac by then. The installation of the device will take 3.799 months. During oh, this period, wonderful. your house will be disconnected from the electricity grid and the community's water mains. Ear protection oh, that's pops convenient. for the noise during the nightly drilling are included in the costs. By what means do you wish to pay? Yeah, uh, Tony will pay for me. Very convenient. May Can I enter the vault, vault then? Over the corroded remains of my wrecked body. Oh, that sounds about right. That. Da, 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 da. What's the What's scratching, that scratching noise? noise? Is that coming from behind the hatch? Yes, it's the postal service replacement cat scratches you catch. The scratching huh. from behind the hatch matches that of postal service replacement cats exactly? It's the unlatched postal service replacement cats hatch. Wow. Uh, 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 Dude, you're no fun at all. I mean, don't you ever have some fun on your job? Define fun. Oh, oh man, well, you're hopeless. Yeah. I'm talking about F-U-N. Like when someone falls into an open sewer right in front of your eye. Yeah, that's a bit, you know. Sets fire to his own foot. Destruction is fun. Yes. As long as it's not happening to you. I like popping the bubbles in bubble wrap. Is that fun, dude? Whoa, if you're into that kind of thing. Unfortunately, I only ever need bubble wrap to pad packages that contain smaller objects which have accidentally been put into boxes of postage level 3. And so that's how the USPS does it. But when it happens, I guess it's party all around, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, uh, uh, yeah, see, see you later. later. I have a great idea here. Take some of these vouchers, my friend. I've got these gift vouchers from Tony's shop. Yeah. Gift vouchers verified. One light lead weight from storeroom one. Supply your address now. Where, where, where to? I mean, what? I, I, I don't know. That's a good question. Address verified. What? Dispatch initiated. Huh? Where the heck's it going? Oh, jeez. Postage being scanned. Can I just yoink Postage the package, correct. please? One light package for dispatch. Pigeon from small pigeonhole is being dispatched. The um, small one. Uh, very complicated system, huh? There it uh, goes. Well. Oh, hey, an operator's platform. Hey, uh, da 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 da. What's hey, up? Hey, you who? Hello. Hmm? Yeah? What's up? Oh, headphones. How about that? I have to make an urgent call. I have to make call. an urgent call. Uh huh. And what, pray tell, has that got to do with me? Well, you're the one with the radio. Keep your hands off. This device is for postal service personnel only. You can transmit till you've got phone coming out of your ears if you want to, but you're not using this device. Capiche? Bruh. Well, can I at least borrow your headphones? Are you mad? I need those for work. Uh, da, 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 da. Well, nice that's pigeons, pigeons now. Oh, messenger pigeons? Yeah, those are magnificent creatures, aren't they? <laughs> if you like contagious diseases. Did you know they take their bearings from the planet's magnetic field? Really? Planet's magnetic, magnetic field, you say? Strong electromagnets around their necks. The fools immediately flew the wrong way. Is that so? Yeah, straight yeah, down. Straight huh? towards this rusty mountain of metal over there. Oh. Hmm. Oh. You're not too busy up here, are you? How's well, work then? Everything's calm here, except for those strange radio calls from this Cletus or something. I haven't had any work at all this morning. Cletus, Cletus. you say? That was a call from me. I have to talk to him at once. No chance, Bubba. The radio station is meant for postal services personnel only. You shouldn't even be up here. Well, too bad. Huh. I'll be going then. You do that. You shouldn't be here anyway. I Silence. agree. You know what? I'm opening this cupboard. I'm putting my hand in this cabinet. Or not. Is there really nothing in here? Well, hey, I can put the planet's magnetic field in here. Isn't that nice? A gadget that manipulates the planet's magnetic field. Oh, this could have been my idea. 
Well, the pigeons get their bearings from the planet's magnetic field, right? So My thoughts exactly, Rufus. If I start fiddling with this a bit, uh, <laughs> I'd love to play God. Well, how about that? What the heck? Uh, one, three, two, what the heck? It's common knowledge that pigeons use the planet's magnetic field to navigate, but only expert ornithrop. Ornithologists like Rufus know that fat pigeons use strong fields, medium sized fields, use for rotate the disks of the magnetic field so that the green relay joints the sort of. Do this! Okay. Sure. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Let's see if I, um. Probably. Like that. Yep. And. Uh, I'll leave it like this for now. Maybe this helps. Yeah, yeah, maybe. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so let's hope that that does it proper. I'm really hoping. Error. Error. Hmm? Alright, suit yourself. What? You telling me that I can't I can't uh frickin' do a do a pigeon? I've got now? these gift vouchers from Tony's shop. Okay. Now one, I don't one, even know what's left, different about that. From storeroom one. Supply your address now. Where, where, where's Light address lead now? weight. What? Dispatch. For a medium sized package, right? They seriously just shot the, the, the cats, huh? Jeez. Postage correct. One light package for dispatch. Light package. What is it? From small pigeonhole is being dispatched. Okay. Small pigeon. So no, yeah, the small pigeon. If the small pigeon's adequate, then I need to get a heavy box. Somehow. Um. This is the big suck. I gotta look at the the the, 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 the stuff again. Da, 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 da. Cause I don't I don't see why a large bird wouldn't be able to carry a small package. Cause that's the the whole hint at the end, isn't it? Small pigeon can't fly far as to carry a big package. And I mean, I can relate fully to that. I have to carry a big package everywhere I go. Anyways, oh, I. Uh... I'll leave it like this for now. Maybe this helps. I don't actually want to skip the mini game. I have half a mind to, but you know, I'm not going to. Oh god. I could though. I could. Hey, you who? Hello. Hmm. Yeah. What's? Up? Uh, da, 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 don't you get don't tired you get at some point? Tired at some point? <laughs> You're messing with me, right? This is Kuvac. I'm as chilled out as can be. What? Pray tell. It should wear me out here. Well, uh, maybe looking that stupid. Um, but uh, can, can I, I transmit, transmit now? now? Not from this device. Can I Where can I make my call my... from? Is it local? No, long distance. <laughs> Good luck with that. Besides this device, there's only one reserve system in the vault of the post office. Okay, I'll use the backup system then. You want to break into the vault? I'm beginning to believe what they say about you. You're suffering from a deluded sense of self-importance. What do you mean suffering? Who's suffering? All right, everyone else is suffering from your deluded sense of self-importance. <laughs> That's more like it. Yeah, that sounds about right. I'll be going then. You do that. You shouldn't be here anyway. I told you. Well, geez. On the next episode, we're gonna figure out a bunch of crap about pigeons, I guess. For now, like, comment, and subscribe, but I'm seriously gonna strangle you. Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.